everyone, it's Misty here. Thank you so much for joining me. So in today's video, I have update number two for the Advent Calendar Project Pan. This was started by Ellen from Hmm Makeup. Everything, as always, will be in the description box down below. So if you're new to me, new to this project, we're basically using either small products or deluxe size samples, kind of anything that would fit in a traditional Advent calendar. I don't have one, I don't use one. So mine are basically in the spreadsheet and I've been randomizing them and going from there. So I do have some empties. I rolled in three new products last month. So I'm currently working on one, two, or I was working on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven products. And I've got a couple of empties. So let's start with those. The first empty I have is this. This is the Clinique Moisture Surge Take the Day Off Makeup Remover. I mentioned in my last video that I needed one and I went ahead and pulled this one in. So this is finished. The second empty are these two. This was the Living Proof Coral Shampoo and Curl Conditioner. I didn't like either one of these. Um, this is a sulfate free shampoo. So, what I didn't understand is, I always wash my hair twice um, when I'm in the shower, and the first wash, it didn't lather. The second wash, it lathered. I don't understand that. Someone explain it. <laughs> so, and I just didn't find the conditioner to be um, conditioning enough. So, I think I got four uses out of each of these, and meh, not worth it to me. The other thing I rolled in was this. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, hairspray, I needed one. And I almost sprayed my hair and I'm so glad that I didn't because this is not a hairspray. This is a volumizing spray. So you're supposed to like give it a shush and then you give it a jush. And it's supposed to give you a little bit of volume. Eh, this one I don't love. I love the Living Proof one. That one's really good. This one is kind of meh. I mean, I've got big hair today anyway because I've been jushing it. But this started out at 60. We're now probably at 34 since I just sprayed it again. <laughs> but I have it down as 36. Excuse me, 36. Um, the next one I was working on was this. This is the Shiseido Synchro Skin Self-Refreshing Foundation Sampler. I got four... Um, I wore the color linen, what did I do with it, today. It is a little deep, but you guys, I really like this foundation. <laughs> I mean, it is beautiful on the skin. Um, I, it's beautiful. I didn't get it to full coverage, so I did go over it with my Rare, just a little bit, Rare Beauty foundation. But on its own, it's beautiful. That is definitely one that's on my radar. Just not in linen. Linen is number... Oh, that's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's it. That's the eighth color. I would probably go with shell. Maybe porcelain. I'd have to look up the undertones. I prefer a neutral undertone. But yeah, this says that I liked it. I really did like it. It's really pretty. So yeah. Three more left on that. I will probably use this light one as a mixer and then these two will have to end up being a bronzer. So one did my entire face just barely for the foundation. So I'm going to guess I'll get at least three or four uses out of the darker ones. So yeah, working on those. The other two that have been in here since the beginning. The first one is this. This is the NARS mini um, orgasm gloss. This started at 19. It's still at 19. I have used this 10 times since the last update for a total of 25 uses. I'm filming this on the 19th, so I'm a bit early again. It, I am just about, <laughs> you guys aren't going to be able to see that. I, like, I'm almost to the bottom of this. The problem is I tried to scrape it off the sides. I couldn't get it. There we go. There we go. I can do it. I did it meaty poopy head <laughs> so you can kind of see the windows so I think this will be an empty next time I have it over a lipstick today I need to stop doing that because it gets all over the place but it's really pretty I don't know that I care for the formula it's a little sticky and I just don't shop Miss A has beautiful um glosses essence makes beautiful glosses I don't need to spend this much money on gloss but yeah so it went down one 
No, it didn't change at all. Even taking the stopper out didn't move the weight, but I have a feeling this will be gone by next update. I hope so. <sighs> this one, you guys, this is gonna take me all year to hit pan. I think I've said that once, but I'm gonna say it again. This is gonna take me all year to hit pan. This is the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. This is a mini bronzer. And I used it 10 times since the last update for a total of 22 uses. You can't even tell. You can't even tell. Every time I wear makeup, um, I put this on. I, I don't know if my numbers are wrong. Um, I don't think they are. I can't remember when I filmed my last update, but we just got back from a hotel stay this last week and I didn't wear makeup at all. Um, if you don't know, we're under... <laughs> We're in the middle of a bathroom remodel. We're not even in the middle. They just barely started. But um, our goal was to stay at a hotel while they were jackhammering the floor and the concrete because they're, we were supposed to be able to sit the shower pan into the foundation so I could have a curbless shower. But there's some kind of rod in the way. I don't know what it means, but it means that they can't do that. So they didn't jackhammer and now we're home and they're gonna be jackhammering on Monday. Roxy and I are gonna lose our brains, I'm sure, and Rob has to work, so it's gonna be, it's gonna be difficult. But yeah, so I'm filming this a little bit early because I have no idea when I'll be able to film again. But my, yeah, my goal is just to hit pan in this, and we're at 22 uses, and there's just, it looks the exact same. It looks the exact same, so yeah. Okay, so I am gonna roll in, so I'm working on one, two, three, four. I'm gonna roll in three more products. And the first one is this. This is the Dior, Dior Show Mascara. This is, all right, I have it on my eyes today. I should have put some, um, here's what I don't like about this. You have to pull it out, but look how big this wand is. Normally these are the type of ones I like. I like when they're, uh, a cone shape that just seems to fit my eyes a bit better. Um, this is all right. I mean, do I look like I have mascara on today? I have no idea. I really should have put on lashes, but guys, I just didn't want to do. Okay, so let's remove the ones that are no longer necessary. Delete. 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 So that leaves me with. 22 products that I'm currently have in my collection in this project and I am working on four of those. So we will do, I'm just gonna put two of the 22 and then we will see what happens. <laughs> so I think I'm only gonna bring in two this time since I'm, I already brought in the, um, oh, what is this, the mascara. Okay. Let's go, two products. Number 12 is, okay. <laughs> Hello, do something. 12 and 18, I'm already working on 18, 10. <sighs> okay, all right, okay. Let's see, we can do this, you can do this. You can do it, we can do it, we can do it, we've got this. <laughs> we can do it. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> All right, okay. The first number was number 12, and that's this. This is a NARS Laguna. Yeah, the NARS Laguna powder. I don't know how many uses will be in this, but I will work alongside this with the um, chocolate Soleil, they look like they're different tones. Oh my word, I can't get it open. There we go. Oh yeah, this is shiny. That'll... It's, it's, um, luminous. So that, I think that will go really well with this one. I do like to mix it with a more luminous uh, bronzer. So this is the Too Faced. This is the NARS Laguna. Actually, they're basically the exact same tone. <laughs> Except one is shimmery and the other is not. Oh, welcome to my brain. 
And the other thing I rolled in was this. <laughs> this is the Laura Mercier um, Caviar Stick Sampler. There are three. So we have um, All Natural, Amethyst, and the Metallic Taupe. I am currently working on one in Pantasy. I've probably only used this a couple of times. This one is in Copper. So this one, so I need to get, I need to get on the ball using these. So I don't foresee these being used up next month at all. The only thing that may be used up will probably be the foundation sampler, possibly the bronzer, maybe this, and possibly this um, mascara. I don't know how long, this is little, so I don't know how many uses I'm going to get out of it. But Avata, thank you so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate you. I hope you're doing well, and I hope you are chugging along. <laughs> I want to say, oh my gosh, how is it the end of February? But I have been rushing January and February so I could get to these doctor's appointments that now I'm like, oh my God, we're almost to my doctor's appointments. Yay, I'm so excited. <laughs> so anyway, thank you so much for joining me. I'm going to do my best to have at least, at least this gloss done. Again, I will probably end up finishing these and surely this will be done. How will I know it's done? I don't know. Is it like white underneath? I guess when no other powder comes off. We'll see. All right, guys. I love you. Thank you so much for joining me. If you haven't already, I would appreciate it if you consider subscribing. Um, I post I post a lot. <laughs> I post a lot. A lot. But anyway, I love you guys, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.